Hi, I'm Michael Harvey, Head of Senior School. At Hazelgren College, we like to give the students a wide range of options for activities and experiences that they can get. One such thing is that before the holidays, a group of staff and students went to NASA Space Camp in America. Today, I'm going to get three students to give you this account of the trip, the wonderful experiences that they had, and the highlights for them. Good afternoon to you all. For those who don't know us, my name's Molly. I'm Sasha. And I'm Layla. On the 15th of September, 21 of us, including teachers, gathered together on a well-awaited trip towards Huntsville, Alabama to begin our space camp tour in America. The week ahead of us involved early morning wake-ups where we ate food like fried chicken for breakfast and days full of activities that finished at 10 p.m. Some of these activities included team building, rocket making, Russian and American space culture, scuba diving, simulated space missions, the 1-6 gravity walk to feel what it was like to jump on the moon, stargazing, the leap of faith and the flying fox. The multi-axis trainer used to experience zero gravity and much more. In return, we taught our leaders about Australian culture and slangs and Aussie classics like The Horses by Dale Braithway and Never Tear Us Apart by In Excess. All of these helped us to gain a better understanding of space and the tasks astronauts endure in order to be eligible in order to launch into space. <laughs> we formed memories with our leaders and students from WA and Costa Rica that will remain with us forever and overall it was one week out of the two we'll never forget. After we finished our week at the space camp, we visited the Bob Jones High School, where we got to sit down and eat in their cafeteria. Then later on, we met all the students. We went off into small groups and visited classrooms where we all had a chance to see how school in America was like, and the students had a chance to ask us questions. After spending the day at the high school, we visited Walmart for a bit. That was a massive highlight for us. Later that night, we went to watch the Gridiron game, and that was amazing. The halftime show was incredible. We got to meet the cheerleaders and the football players. After that, we flew out to Orlando where we got to visit Disney World, which was amazing. It was literally everyone's childhood dream come true. We also got to visit Typhoon Lagoon and Universal Studios. And some people went to the Halloween Fright Night and others got to relax by the pool. After Orlando, Florida, we flew to San Francisco. On the first night, we went to a baseball game and then ended up getting lost in the city. Thanks, Mr. Taggart. The next day, we had a city tour where we got to see every beautiful sight in San Francisco. We also got to visit Alcatraz, which was an amazing just being there. That just being there was something so surreal. The whole trip was a once in a lifetime experience and I'm so grateful I was lucky enough to go and share it with some amazing people.